Hello, YouTube! Welcome to the final episode of Mario Galaxy! Um, yeah, this is the first time you've seen webcam the entire series. Sorry, I had to look over there to do something. <laughs> uh, this is the first time you've seen webcam the entire series. Uh, yeah. Um, if you look at, like, the Star Troll and that, you're like, wait, that's off, though. We had, we had a whole 120 stars last year. That's because... I didn't know I had videos doing the purple coins, but those don't unlock until you do the final battle. So I'm doing that now. Now, obviously, you're seeing out of. What the hell? My controller stopped working. Ah, uh, you do this now. <laughs> they do this now? <laughs> Anyways, though, let's um, do this. It's time. Do you want to go to the location of your special one in the center of the universe? Yeah. Because I can't do anything else yet. Okay, then. Off we go. Oh, look, that's cool. Hey, look! Peach's castle! Go, Mario. Oh, I thought I was going to be voice acting for a second, so I didn't read the text. Oh, Bowser changed flag. Oh, no, no. The fate of the universe. I only have 22 lives. I'm assuming this is going to work like a 3D world level if you get in the spotlight. Beow, 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 beow. Oh, no, you won in these spotlights. They are gravity fields. Even let me get up here. Oh, that lava world in the garden really prepped me because I've seen all these elements before. But otherwise, they'd be brand new. Different biome types. <laughs> the galaxy's not cool enough to actually have proper levels. What the frick? Oh, 
That's why you're not cool enough to have actual levels. Cause you do that! Water? No. Desert. Wow. I, I, I was mostly... At least I thought I was making a joke when I said, oh yeah, all the biome types. But no. That is legit what's happening. I need a coin. I don't need star bits, I need a coin. Look, it's the Space Junk Galaxy stuff. What? They go away! Stuff like that's so stupid. Like, give me a break. They give you a lot of one-ups in this level. Excuse me, we haven't had Gusty Garden uh, biome yet. We haven't had Grassland. Aw, oh, what? Bull crap. I don't like stuff like that. That is so dumb. I get it, it's the final level. But that doesn't mean I want to see bull crap like that. It's like, oh, it's the final level! What? They now have an excuse to do bull crap. No! That's not how final levels work. Just because it's the final level doesn't mean it should, oh yeah, natively have bull crap in it. I'm just gonna ignore it. Exactly what I did last time. <laughs> Why did it go down when I wanted to throw? Hey, at least I have more lives than I started. You know? So not too long ago, I asked, well, I want a coin, where's a coin? It's pretty ironic I didn't grab a coin. This is a pretty cool level, I suppose, though. Why didn't it... Okay, everything's still recording properly. Ugh. Look at her princess speech! Too bad, cause she's with me!
know what? I thought it was gonna be Bowser though. Little Bowser of boss fights just gonna be the normal one except with Bowser Jr. Finally! You got here just in time to see the creation of my galaxy in the center of the universe. Watch and weep! From this galaxy I'll rule a great galactic empire with Peach by my side. It will last forever. I will rule every pitiful corner of the universe. So Mario, as you can see, I got big plans. It's time you is at the top of my list. What if Mario's like, you know what? I like this idea. Can I like join in? What am I supposed to do? I really don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. What am I doing? Oh, what? No, that hurt me. What am I supposed to do? Game, you can't just throw elements and be like, oh yeah, they're gonna understand what to do. I don't know what to do! It's not like, oh, it's an early game mechanic, but it's just something you have to figure out. It's the final boss! God damn it. The spiny things are my least here things in this game. They haven't since day one. God! What, am I supposed to get Bowser's face to land on one? Okay, no, you just spin him, apparently. Because I, th I thought I tried that already, but apparently not. Okay, why does it... Why did it work that one time? It hurt me, not him. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? What am I? I don't know. This this fight sucks. It's almost it, it's just as bad as the other Bowser fights in this game. It's about to say this one's worse because it's cryptic as hell. So that means when we can't see. This one at least isn't cryptic, I feel. I feel like this one makes a lot more sense off right off the bat. Because I'm familiar with these things. 
Oh crap! I thought I was closer to that one. I really did, actually. God, he launched all of them right! Doesn't go into ball form if you get him. I won one of the coins on that planet. I'm assuming every phase... Oh, good music, though. I'm assuming every phase does not have a save point. I'm assuming if you die once, you have to start fully over. Really? So I've got to daredevil this, which is not going to end well, by the way. That's what I thought. And I'm gonna go through all- Okay, thank goodness, I didn't have to go through that dialogue. I thought that was the I have peach dialogue. No, it wasn't. Okay, now that I think I know what to do... I know what to do in the second and third parts. I don't know what to do in the first part, though. I'm still kind of clueless of why it worked some of the time. And not all of it. I, I kind of don't know why it worked, um, which is bad game design. That's one of the few things in this game I will say is bad, B-A-D, game design. I don't, I don't know. I don't understand why sometimes I do damage, why I don't. Because all the times it worked, he's been right on me, he was right on me that time, and you know what happened? Okay, have to hit him in the face. That's, that's it. Camera, I, I swear to God. It wasn't his freaking face, me. Damn it! I, I didn't think your everything was immediately gonna change. I wanted the coin. Hit both of us, Bowser. I'm a god. Okay, as far as Bowser fights go, this is the like the only one in this game so far that's actually even remotely fun or interesting. Despite my issues with it, the first phase kind of blowing. 
it's it's definitely challenging. Not as challenging once you actually know what you're freaking doing though. But no, it's actually kind of a, it's actually a fun fight. It's actually a fun fight. I will give it that. Bad game is at the beginning, but fun fight still. Better than the previous one, at least, so far. And the music's baller. It's one of those boss fights, though, where the boss breaks all the coins! So you can't use them. I just have one wish for this possibly final phase. another face, right? Or not? That was it? He didn't spin jump that time! That's what made the second Bowser fight so evil. He spin jumped. The fight itself, the second and third faces were really fun. The first face was actually good once I figured out what I was doing. Um, and that he had to like spin on his face. Um, the camera, the camera screwed though. No, this isn't it. I refuse to believe that that was it though. He's gonna come out of nowhere and grab the star, right? I do know the. I, that may just be me though, knowing Galaxy 2's final boss fight. That I think that. The Galaxy 2 final boss fight is awesome! That's it. Really is it? I was right! It's not over, right? No! My galaxy! My empire! This can't be happening! Ah! Oh, it is over. Oh, that's a shame. It was actually a good final fight.
Okay, it's literally, we haven't seen since literally the first area. Oh, uh, rebirth in the galaxy or something. My galaxy did it before Doctor Who. <laughs> That's not how proportions work. Humans aren't that big. Do you hear the baby stars? The newborns will grow up to become new galaxies someday. When stars die, they turn into stardust and scatter across the cosmos. Eventually, that stardust reforms to create a new star, and so the cycle continues. But the cycle never repeats itself in quite the same way. So you'll see. In this game, you only come across like five civilizations and no big cities or dynamics like this. Oh, that's right, uh, carries S in the stars. Even all of you. before you do purple coins. Like, for you watching this, this is the last episode. But for me, I don't know how many more episodes I have to record. Because I still do all the purple coin stuff. I still need 15 more stars. Um. <laughs> so, it's over for you all. You're probably getting Galaxy 2 soon. I'm not. I have to do purple coins. Camera sucks. Uh, the camera, I heard that the camera in this game was supposed to be decent. No, no it isn't. It's, it's bad. I wouldn't say it's epic Mickey bad. Because that's a whole nother level of a really good game hampered by an awful camera. As I think that's this game's biggest flaw. Because especially since this game is so ambitious with its gravity, you need to have a good camera. Or else the different gravity switches is gonna kill you. I I don't know how many deaths I've had from that, but probably a lot. Um, 
The horrible camera I think is more passable in Epic Mickey, because you didn't have weird gravity stuff throwing at you off at every step. Um, both games have awful cameras. Epic Mickey's is still worse, the control. But I feel like while this camera is better, it's hampered more in this gameplay. That being said, that's me spoiled by games like Xenoblade and Breath of the Wild that have fantastic cameras. I'm, I, I'm, those games have spoiled me of what a good camera can be. Spider-Man is another one, a fantastic camera. All of those spoil me of what a good camera is like. Um, this camera is definitely 15, 16 years old. Uh, by the time this is going up, I don't, I don't know what year it's going to be. But the, the, the camera's old. You can tell that this is an older game. You can tell this is from the 2000s, not the 2010s, not the 2020s. You can tell it's older because the camera is not good. Motion controls also despise. I'm, I'm the kind of person that I always turn off motion controls. Breath of the Wild, motion controls are off. Instantly. First thing I did when I got in the game was turn off motion controls. Because I don't like motion controls. I, in my opinion, they hurt games instead of helping them. I have shaky hands, I have bad depth perception. I'm bad at aiming. Motion controls make it hard for me to play games. Um, and you can probably definitely have helped in some of the more motion control heavy parts of this game. And especially parts where you have to be very particular about what buttons you press to do certain jumps, like long jumps, ground pounds, because they all use the same two flipping buttons. So when you had to be really precise, I, I, I'm not good, I'm physically not good at that. So that really hurts me. Like, I'm so thankful this game doesn't have quick time events. Because again, quick time events are stuff I immediately turn off because I can't always do them well. Sp like, Spider Man and quick time events are okay because they're very lenient. But something like Xenoblade, those ones aren't generous. They are harsh. Um, so I gotta turn them off. Uh, music in this game is fantastic. Uh, the world design is also amazing. Um, graphically, very, very good looking game. It's a, it's a gorgeous game. Um, the presentation in this game is fantastic. So much for playing my game. But to get the final level, you have to beat the entire game again with uh, Luigi, which is dumb. <sighs> yeah, you've already seen that final chapter in the storybook. Because I read it most likely on camera already. Um, I'm not done with my thoughts, I don't think, so I'm gonna actually quickly enter the common observatory again. Wow. Honestly though. That's really cool. See? <laughs> Can I change the icon? There's only those four options, and that's just dumb. It's so dumb how little options there are. Welcome back. I knew you would return eventually. Please look down to your feet. This number you see represents the number of power stars you need to access. Oh! That's how many you need to be before you can replay the game as Luigi. Mail? I got mail! It's just, um. Yeah. I've already rescued Peach. Yeah, um. Even like here, the camera sucks. I don't know, but I, I do. I do feel like people give this game too much credit for having great like exploration because there really isn't much exploration. Like obviously, like I know Galaxy Two is supposed to be really linear, but this game's also kind of linear, and that is like another one of my big complaints with this game is I don't. If I'm playing a 3D platformer or a 3D adventure game, I don't want it to be. The levels themselves be linear. Like I know, like Xenoblade's a lot more of like a linear plot than like something like Breath of the Wild, where you have one place and there's one place you gotta go, and it tells you where you need to go. But the world itself still isn't linear. There's still a lot of exploring. Where I feel this game's very linear, which I'm, I don't know, not my not my favorite thing. Um, of course, my life kind of got reset. Of course. 
Um. I will say, there's a lot of people that consider this the best game ever made, and I don't know. In my opinion, you need to play more games, because this game's fantastic, but it's not even my favorite 3D Mario. It really isn't. Odyssey, in my opinion, is way better. And I mean, I'm not a platformer guy, so that's definitely where a lot of my stuff comes from. And how I view this game, I view this game as someone who's not a platformer. So of course my views of this game are very different from someone who loves platformers and mostly plays platformers. As a non-platformer, this game's really good, but far from my favorite platformer. I'd rather play Odyssey. And I'm definitely gonna be playing Galaxy 2, don't get me wrong. I, one of my favorite Let's Plays on this, on the, on YouTube is a Galaxy 2 Let's Play. Of course I'm gonna play it. The game, even though I've never really played it beyond like the first like, again, 10 stars, it still has a special place in my heart. Something that the first Galaxy game didn't have. It didn't have a special place in my heart. Because I really had only watched one Let's Play of it, which I believe, if I were to Google it now since I actually have internet right now, it's not down was it from a channel called Purple Rodri. Um, it was a very fun playthrough. I loved it growing up. Uh, the one time I watched it. Um, am I still subscribed? Yes, I am! Hasn't uploaded in two years, unfortunately. Um, well, let me go back and Look quickly and re look at that. Yeah! His galaxy playthroughs. <laughs> um, yeah. It looks like he's better at the game because he did it faster than me. Um, <laughs> uh, there's no way I'm below 38 videos. <laughs> No, it's a great game. It is. It is. Um, I do think I'm gonna like Galaxy 2 more. Um, as I don't know, I, I don't. I, one thing I don't like is like there's 15 gal. There's really only 15 galaxies in this game. All the rest, one star, you're done. Where Galaxy 2, everything except for like the Bowser fights has at least two. Even like the one-off galaxies, not only is there, I believe, less of them, but they have comments too. They have secret stuff, and when I do Galaxy 2, chances are, I'm not doing green stars. I'm not going to, there's... Green stars like double the star count in the game, I'm not doing that, but... I don't know, I don't know. This has been Fall Fun to Record, I hope you enjoy. I will see you next time, whatever that is. Well, Galaxy 2, but whenever that is for me. <laughs> I will see you all.